gonna win this. I don't think so. Richie, we'll rebuild your big pile of... Big pile? It was a carefully constructed product display. Uh, we'll have this place cleared up in no time, Richie. There's just one more box of toys to put out. Oh, uh, let me help, Dr. P. Oh, no. I'll take care of it. Thank you. Ah! Nobody panic. <laughs> let me clear it up. Uh-uh. I've got this. Whoa! Oh, how are we gonna clean this off? Impossible. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> Toto just gave me an idea. I think we need to play with these toys some more. What? Awesome, Hoopa. Toto is gonna love this. Thanks, Dr. Panda. It walks, talks, and does perfect backflips, too. Watch. Tinker! Whoa! Tinker! Um, maybe we should make it so it doesn't kick stuff around. Easy fix. It's just a loose screw in one of its back legs. All fixed. Great job, Hoopa! Let's show Toto his new toy! <sighs> hey, hey, watch this! <laughs> I can do better than that! Yeah? Show me! <laughs> Yay! Bull. <sighs> There's Toto. Hey, Toto, we've got a surprise for you. <gasps> Bull? But you already have a ball. Uh -uh. Bull. <gasps> uh, oh, I see. No worries, Toto. We'll soon have you playing ball. <laughs> Toto, meet Robo Toto. Toto! Toto? Toto! Toto! <laughs> Toto! 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 Wow! <laughs> Hoopa, can you unfix his back leg? I have an idea. Sure thing, Dr. Panda. 
What's your plan, Dr. Panda? Just wait and watch. <laughs> Whoa! Oh, that trick was super awesome, Toto. <laughs> yes! Amazing! The best trick of all! <laughs> Yay! <laughs> Toto, <laughs> it's the toy Hoopa and I made. Whoa! Whoa. Wow. How clever! Thanks, but all Toto really wanted was to play with his ball. Oh yeah, I guess we didn't really let him. No worries, I think Toto has found a new playmate to play ball with. Toto! <laughs> Toto! <laughs> <laughs> Great job, Hoopa. Robo Toto is the perfect ball playing toy. <laughs> Thanks. Uh, anyway, if a shark comes, I'll just bop it on the nose. Bop, bop, bippity, bop, bop. Whoa! Oops. <gasps> what did you just do? Relax. I've got it. <laughs> Be careful. Stop that! Keep calm, Bip. Stay in the middle of the boat. Oh, uh, oh. Hey! Whoa! Bip! Help! Shipwreck! No worries! We're gonna save you! Mm. Of course! The helicopter! Come on, Toto! Some helicopter trip? What an adventure, right? Ah, did you fix the oven, Hoopa? Almost. See, I spotted some other problems with it. Okay. I tightened your loose door, loosened your tight shelf, stopped your fan squeaking. That's great, but I have a big order from Moo, so. All I need to do now is put everything back together again. Easy fix. Good. Toto and I have to make the dough first anyway. Let's get to work, Toto. Okay, let's see. Flour and water, check. Yeast, oil, and salt, check. Let's make some dough. Dr. Pandir. Great timing. The dough's ready to bake. 
Uh-oh. Oh, the handle came off. Ah, so that's where that was supposed to go. Easy fix, Dr. Panda. <laughs> How are you going to bake Moo's bread rolls now? I don't know. Maybe Leo can share his bread cucumber with all of us. Hey, you've just given me an idea. Mmm, your soup smells divine, Moo. So, when do we eat? Mm, now would be good. Not until Dr. Pander brings the bread rolls. Hi, everyone. Great, the rolls are here. Yeah, Dr. Oh, Panda. I'm so hungry. Moo! Dr. Panda, what's this? These bread rolls aren't baked. Ah. Uh... I know, Moo, but it's okay. I have a plan. <laughs> Leo, in the bakery, you told me you know how to make a campfire. Can you make one for us now? Of course. We'll dig a fire pit right over here and get some firewood from over there. Oh, not too close to the fire, Toto. Come and see how Moo is making her bread roll. Oh, Dr. Pander, this is so much fun. Oh, and it tastes great, too. Mm -mm. Hmm, need more soup over here. Oh, no! Koopa! You've hung the wallpaper the wrong way around. Huh? Uh-uh. Oh, no! Mess. Whew, you got that right, Toto. We'll have to start over before June comes back. Yoo-hoo! How are you getting on? <gasps> no. No, 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 no! Uh, sorry, June. There's a little misunderstanding. This is all wrong. We can't open my art show with the room looking like this. It doesn't match my paintings. What's this? Painting. I think he's trying to cheer you up. <gasps> so fresh. So free, yet so comforting. Like a cool spring day. This is what the room should look like. Hey, so why don't you and Toto paint it like that? The room itself could be part of your art show. Yes! Well, that's an excellent idea. Now, Toto, will you help me paint your wonderful picture again on the wall this time? What? <laughs> yes! All of these walls. <laughs> Ta -da! Whoa. Hello, and welcome to the show. Wow, this looks awesome. It definitely does. This is spectacular. Hmm. Splatters of paint spaced irregularly. Patterns in dinosaur and broccoli green. More splatters in pickle green. But altogether, it feels like... like a cool spring day. This looks lovely, June. Oh, thank you. But it wasn't just me. I think the artists have done a great job. Both of them. Yay! Yay! <laughs> thank you. And thank you. <laughs> Dr. Panda said you needed some eggs. Oh, wonderful. Thank you. Hey, you come back here. <sighs> it's so nice and quiet out here. Oh, sorry. I have to get this. <laughs> uh, someone's spending a lot of time on his phone today. Yeah? Uh, I lost the chickens and I broke Moe's laundry line. Okay. Uh, could you ask Olette to cut up the ripped stage curtain and use the laundry line to make new bunting? 
Smart thinking, Dr. Panda. Yellow, the chicken stole the last of my chocolate. How can I bake any chocolate cake without any chocolate? Oh. Mm, chocolate, chocolate, chocolate. Oh, have we got any chocolate? <gasps> uh, no. How about a cracker, though? Yeah. Oh, sorry, Moo. I... I know. You have to take this. Dr. Panda, I found the chickens. Oh, great. They're in this apple tree, and I can't get them down. Hang on. Cake, chocolate, and now apples. <gasps> the chickens must be hungry. Try tempting them down with some food. <laughs> ow! What was that noise? That was me saying ow. No, not that. The other noise. Oh, an apple hit the rain barrel. <gasps> That's it. Give the apples to June and tell her to bake an apple pie instead. Then give the barrel to Bip to use as a drum. You're so smart, Dr. Panda. I'm on it. Okay, Moo. Everything should be fixed now. We can finally enjoy it. Where are you going? I want to go home. Oh, uh, let me, let me make one more call. <laughs> Not another one. You've been on that phone the whole time. <laughs> Bullet, Moo's coming back. <gasps> Moo's coming back. Let's go, go, go. Team effort. Oh, this is the best birthday ever. Thank you, all of you. Moo, this song is for you. And a one, two, three, four. It's your birthday. Happy birthday, Moo. It's your birthday. Happy birthday, Moo. It's your birthday. Happy birthday. <laughs> Come on. It's, it's your, your birthday. birthday. streets of Panda City. May -may. That's right, Dr. Panda. Moo's chickens are missing. Moo, can you tell us what happened? Well, my chickens are missing. Um, okay, uh, thanks, May, -may. Oh, if anyone spots Moo's chickens, please let us know. Um, oh, yes! <laughs> Good idea, Dr. Panda. <laughs> is here in the studio with us to talk about the trophy she's made for the sandcastle competition. Thank you, Olette. June, what an amazing trophy. Can you tell our viewers what it's made of? Just twigs, Dr. Panda. I wove them together. Oh, wow, that's incredible. How long did that take? <clears throat> Follow the script. Oh, sorry. Uh, so, can you tell our viewers what it's made of? <laughs> you just asked me that. <laughs> Mm -hmm. uh, oh, oh, we have some breaking news. Over to May May in downtown Panda City. May May? Oh, what a terrible day for Panda City. The town hall flowers have been ruined. <laughs> City's much loved forest ranger. And you wanted to talk to us about seeds. Well, Bip called me up and said you didn't have enough guests. So seeds! I They're such wonderful things, aren't they, Dr. Panda? Yes, wonderful! <laughs> seeds! C can you tell us more about them, Leo? Well, of course. There are lots of different seeds. Uh oh, sorry. We have more breaking news. May May. A bad day for Panda City just got even worse. The sandcastles in the sandcastle competition have been destroyed. Oh, no. Wait, th those tracks look like. Never mind that, Dr. 
Panda. No sand castles, no trophy. Not that was going to be the big finish of our show. Now what do we do? <gasps> We're still live on TV. <gasps> So, Leo, tell me, there are many interesting seeds. Do you have a favorite one? Oh, I certainly do. These are Panda City pine seeds, a very rare species found only in... Whoa! Do you hear that? It sounds like a... <laughs> <laughs> uh, we are? Hi, everyone! Maker and help fix watches and clocks. What's that funny thing you're wearing on your head? <laughs> this is my magnifier. It helps me see things close up. <laughs> tick tock, tick tock. That's right, Toto. I have to fix Leo's pocket watch. Ah, the big cog is worn out. Now I can replace it. Ah. And then I have to put the other cogs back in the right order. <laughs> ah, that's it. It now works perfectly. Yay! Oh, hello? Dr. Panda, please come and fix the town clock. It won't stop chiming and no one can hear my ice cart bell. No worries, Moo. I'll come right away. What did you say? I said I'll be right there. Time to get time to go, Toto. <laughs> Hi, Moo. Moo! Oh, Doctor Panda, there it goes again. Moo, you have to make it stop. No worries, Moo. I'm on it. <laughs> Here, you can play with this while I fix the clock. <laughs> It's a lot bigger than I'm used to. That should stop the noise. Aha! There's a piece of wood stuck between those two cogs. Must have fallen down. Now. To get to the problem, I'll have to remove all of these cogs. Yeah. Oh. Oh, this is really heavy. Oh, this will be trickier than I thought. Hey, if that isn't my good friend, Dr. Panda, what is he doing? Oh, phew. Hello, Hoopa. Hi, Dr. Panda. It looks like you're struggling with those cogs. Would you like some help? Oh, that'd be awesome, thanks. Happy right over. 
Hey, Dr. Panda, I filled more sacks with leaves, and now there's no more room in my truck. Could you take these to the park entrance, please? Sure. Let me help you. This is so exciting. This button opens the doors. This dial says how fast the tram is going. And this lever makes it go forward. Uh, Richie! Oh! Uh, oh! Careful there, Richie. I'm sorry, Dr. Panda. I was just wondering what it's like to be a tram driver. Oh! <laughs> Next stop, park entrance. Uh, uh, huh? huh? Yahoo! Hey! Dr. Panda, I need to get out here. Stop the tram. I'm trying, but the lever is stuck. Next stop, fountain. Uh, 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 Richie, uh, please help. The tram isn't stopping. Maybe something's wrong. Like to call the next stop, Richie? Next stop, park entrance. Oh, that's my stop. <laughs> hey, Dr. Panda, are my clothes nice and clean yet? Yep, everything's done, Hoopa. <sighs> Thanks. Oh, there's nothing like the smell of fresh, clean clothes. No, <gasps> my trousers! Did I get bigger since I came in earlier? Oh, <gasps> they've shrunk! Oh no! I'm sorry, Hoopa. They must have been washed too hot. All the bottom half clothes had to go in the hot wash. But why, Richie? Well, Bip had ketchup stains everywhere, even on his shorts. I needed a lot of hot water to get them clean. But I can't wear them now, unless I shrink too. But that's not gonna happen. Ah, my socks! Uh, maybe they just need a little stretch. <laughs> now let go. <gasps> wow. Now stretch them the other way. Yeah. I could fit both feet in here and legs. Hi, Dr. Panda. Oh, our clothes are waiting for us. Uh, the thing is... <gasps> what happened to my scarf? Uh, I'm afraid it shrank. Is this going to keep me warm? Where's my white basketball jersey? And where's my other red glove? 
Uh, I think I found it. And the ketchup stains are completely gone. <laughs> hey, everyone. Oh, nice color, Bip. Oh, I've been shopping all day, and I couldn't find a thing I liked. This day cannot get any worse. <gasps> What's this? A very small t-shirt. First, I can't find any new clothes, and now my old clothes are ruined. Hmm. Oh. Well, you like the color of Bip's shirt. Maybe it would make a nice dress. Hmm. Yeah. I'd need a belt, though. Oh, maybe you could use a let scarf. Oh, that's perfect. Thanks, Olette. But how am I going to keep warm while ice skating? Um, how about a sock hat? Hoopa, may I? Uh, sure, Dr. Panda. Try that. Oh, yes. Oh, this will keep me warm as I glide across the ice. Hoopa, my jeans are amazing on you. Thanks, May May. I think I like my new look. Me too. Your shrunken T-shirt is just my size, Hoopa. That looks great, Dr. Panda. All thanks to my special clothes sorting system. <laughs> clothes swapping is so much more fun than clothes shopping. You saved the day, Dr. Panda. And you did it in style. You have an eye for fashion. Hey, you should be a fashion designer. <laughs> well, that's an adventure for another day. See you next time, everyone. Goodbye, Goodbye Dr. Panda. Bye-bye. <laughs> okay, why don't you try going down the ladder and dipping one toe in? <laughs> Keep going. <sighs> That's it. No! <laughs> no worries, Olette. You know, maybe we should start smaller. <laughs> okay, so just dip your toe in here. <laughs> That's it. Now try putting your whole foot in. <laughs> Good going. Now the other foot. <gasps> awesome! You're standing in the water! <laughs> I'm standing in the water! <gasps> I'm standing in the water! <gasps> oh, sorry, Dr. Panda. Oh, no worries. We just need to start even smaller. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, let's start really small. Just try and dip your toe in this bowl of water so you get used to the feel of it. Um, How does that feel? It, it feels okay. Great! Are you ready to try the pool again? Yes! I think I'm ready! <laughs> Panda, why are Bip and May May sinking? Yeah. Bip! May May! Please get out of the pool right away! Huh? <laughs> Is everyone okay? Uh, everyone's fine, Hoopa. What happened? Uh, there was a bit of an accident with the pipe that brings the water into the pool. But the water fountain is fixed. Oh, I guess there's no way I'll get to go in the pool now. You were so close. Yeah, and we were having so much fun. <laughs> Toto's having fun in his pool, though. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hang on. I've got an idea. We're going to make a giant inflatable ball pit! Whoa! That is a cool idea, Dr. P! Are you 
Ready, Olette? Mm-hmm. One, two, three, jump! <laughs> this is so much fun! Hey there, Moo! How was the farmer's market? I haven't been to the farmer's market yet. That road led me right back here. Mm -hmm. That's strange. Easy fix. I'll just show you another way to take. Thanks. But be quick. I need to get a move on. Okay, so first take Panda Main Street, then a left onto Garden Gate Road, then another left onto Panda Town Square. You'll be there in no time. I hope so. I need to get these pies onto my store now. <laughs> told me, but all the roads were closed off. Huh? Those roads can't be closed. Richie has just used that route to get to the park. Is this the park? Huh? Uh, no. <laughs> well, it should be, because I followed all the signs and they led me right here. Which roads did you try to go down? All the roads Hoopa told me to. Main Street, Garden Gate Road, and Panda Park Road. But those were the roads you told me to close off, Hoopa. I did? When? <laughs> On the phone, remember? Huh? But you hung up while I was giving directions to Richie. Hung up when... Oh, I see. I think there's been a mix-up. No, this is terrible. How long will it take to open all the roads again? A while. <laughs> I used a lot of cones and roadblocks. But I need to sell my pies. And I still need to get to the park. Mo, oh, the market's so close, but there's no way to get there. Whoa. Awesome obstacle course, Toto. <laughs> That's it! We can make an obstacle shortcut to get you to the market. We'll use all the cones and roadblocks we have. And the park is on the way, too. Can I borrow your skateboard, please, Bip? Oh, sure. Dr. Panda? Why don't you have some, Dr. Panda? You look so hot and tired. You should have taken the shortcut, Dr. P. <laughs> oh, I'm fine. Uh, but I think we're going to need more ice cream, Toto. I wonder if Hoop has fixed the mixer. Oh, hey, Dr. Panda. Great news. Your mixer is doing the side-to-side -side thing again and the round and round and round thing. Oh, it mixes and stirs. That's a relief. I need it to whisk, too, so the ice cream will be soft and fluffy. Working on it, Dr. Panda. Oh, great. Thanks, Hoopa. Come on, Toto. We need to get to the pool. Chocolate first, then strawberry, and sprinkles on the top, not on the sides. And sprinkles on the top. Here you go. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> Eat it quickly now, Richie. It's going to melt. Mmm. Can I have another one, please? Sure. Oh, sorry, May May. There's none left. But no worries. We'll make more and come back later. Ha! Fastest. Eek. 
All tip-top, Dr. Panda. I also added a little boost so the ice cream will be even more light and fluffy. Oh, great. Thanks, Hoopa. I need to make a new batch of ice cream right away. Dr. Panda, we hope you don't mind, but your ice cream is so delicious. And super tasty. Uh, Dr. Panda, I need a new ice cream cone as a matter of urgency. Well, I'm just about to make some more. <laughs> Whoa! Oh! Uh, mm. uh, I think it's broken again. Oh, no! I'm sorry, everyone. I can't make ice cream without the ice cream maker. <gasps> <gasps> Don't worry, Dr. Panda. I can stir and I can whisk. But you won't be able to go fast enough, Hoopa. Hey, wait! My ice cream cart has a freezer. And I think I know how to whisk my ice cream. Let's put the mixture in the ice cart. Bip, can you show us where that shortcut was? Follow me, Dr. P. Ha! See you all at Moose Farm! Oh, oh. Uh. Ready, Dr. P? Whoa, this fruity, rooty patootie is amazing! Mine too! Vanilla and chocolate! <gasps> Who'd have thought it? Dr. Panda, we've made something to say thanks! Huh? Wow! That looks great! No! <sighs> we'll never make this film by tonight. Well, let's see what we've filmed already. <laughs> Maybe it's not so bad. Very refreshing. <gasps> the news I bring is... <gasps> Tell me! <gasps> Listen to me, Gregor. <gasps> <gasps> Toto is right. I look like a monster. The film is a total disaster. Hmm. Then maybe we should make a film about a disaster. Olette, you're a monster. <gasps> I beg your pardon? What? No, no, no. I mean, you can play a monster. Then it's okay if you knock things over. It's what we need. Mm. Oh, oh, can I still be in it? Sure. We need someone who's scared of the monster. You won't need to learn any lines this time. And June, you'll get to make lots more things. Oh, yes. And I have a really special role for you, Toto. <laughs> June, that looks amazing. Olette, you are going to be the biggest monster anyone has ever seen. Bigger than Panda City. But how, Dr. Panda? Because these are going to be houses. Next to them, you'll look really big. Are you ready to break stuff? Always. Okay, Hoopa. Now, imagine you've just seen the monster coming toward you, and action. Ah! A monster is attacking Panda City! <laughs> and action! <laughs> wow, that looks amazing! And action! <laughs> and stop! Great acting, Olette! <laughs> And stop! That's it! We filmed everything we need! Hooray! Yay! Oh, great! Welcome, everyone! Now, we were going to show you the days of Queen Charlotte, but we thought we'd make something a little bit different. Whoa! 
We hope you'll enjoy it. Attacking Panda City! <gasps> it's a very bad day for our city. Who is brave enough to scare away this monster? Wait, who's this? Da -da -da -da! Mega Turtle is here to save the day. What a hero! You're here, Dr. Panda. We can't find the grapes. Or bread. Or tomatoes. No worries. Let's start with the tomatoes. They're right over here. Uh, those aren't tomatoes, Dr. Panda. Oh. Come on, Ben. Uh -huh. We have to keep our customers happy. <laughs> What's going on, Richie? We're making things easier to find, Dr. Panda. But we can't find anything. This is the place for lettuce and tomatoes, not toothpaste. No, Dr. Panda. First thing in the morning, I brush my teeth. So the first thing in the store should be toothpaste. It makes much more sense. Not to me. Richie, can you tell everyone where things are, please? Like bread? Simple. Go down the aisle. When you're past my breakfast, take a left. Then right at my mid-morning snack, and you're there. Easy. Well, no, it's not. I've been looking for ingredients all this time, and I still have to make our special meal. I've been coming here since I was a boy, and even I can't find my way around. Hmm, what to do? Mm. Hey, why don't you let me make lunch for all three of you? Bip, can you fetch folding chairs from the picnic aisle? <laughs> it's the cheese aisle now, but yeah, sure. What about our shopping, Dr. Panda? Why don't you give your shopping lists to Richie? He and Bip will do your shopping for you. Certainly. Now, who's ready for lunch? Oh, yummy. Oh, yes, please. I am. <laughs> Wonderful. There's nothing like eating with friends. And we got our shopping done at the same time. Thanks, you two. You've made our customers really happy. Wow, well, that was my goal, Dr. Panda. Oh, that was so much fun. Hey, do you want some dessert, too? Oh, what is for dessert, Dr. Panda? Our new crackers <laughs> in lots of exciting flavors. Oh, uh... Okay. Oh. Oh, they're actually really yummy. Mm. Marshmallow with just a, a subtle hint of broccoli. Delicious. <laughs> <laughs> Wonderful service, Dr. Panda. You should be a waiter in a restaurant. <laughs> well, that's an adventure for another day. See you next time, everyone. Bye, Bye Dr. Dr. Panda. Hi, Dr. Panda. What are you going to do today? Hi, everyone. Today, I'm going to be a news reporter. What does a news reporter do? I write stories about interesting things that happen in Panda City so everyone can read what's going on. Oh, that sound means there's a new story on the Panda City News app. Olette won a rowing race with the fastest ever time. Ha <laughs> ha! That's the kind of thing people want to read about. <sighs> and they want to see it, too. Let's get out there and find some big, exciting stories. Oh. Hi, 
Hoopa. Hi, Dr. Patty. I saw your new story about Olette. I've got a big story, too. Come quickly. We'll be right over. Uh, 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 hi, Hoopa. What's the story? Look, the street has flooded. Oh, this is a huge story. The whole of Panda City could flood. Hmm. Oh, no. A plastic bag is blocking the drain. Whoa! You sure fixed that problem. Uh, but now we don't have a story. <laughs> no worries. We'll find something else to write about. Oh, hey, Leo. Dr. Panda, I have a big story for you, but you'll have to be fast. That is a very rare lilac sapphire butterfly. Pretty. Oh, is it the last of its kind? That would be big news! Shh, don't scare it. <laughs> I don't think so, Bip. Let's try to get closer to take a picture. Okay, but keep quiet or it'll fly away. Oh, no! Well, there goes another big story. I'm sorry, Leo. I, I accidentally stepped on this. That litter doesn't belong in the woods. <laughs> oh, Let! You're the top story. Look. Oh, that's brilliant. I've always wanted to be in the Panda City News. Oh, hi, June. Are you painting in the park today? No, I've been painting a mural on a wall in the city square all week. I'm going there now to finish it. Oh, you should let Dr. Pander know. It could make a great new story. Oh, it looks amazing. Oh, be careful not to touch it. The paint hasn't oh, dried yet. Another story ruined. I'm sorry about your mural, June. Every story today has been spoiled by litter. How awful. Maybe we should do a story about that. Yeah, it's the biggest problem in our city right now. Where's it coming from? Who's doing it? Maybe there's a mystery litterer about. I think I know just what to write. Under City is flooded with litter. Where the litter is coming from is unclear. Some think it's the work of a mystery litterer. Oh, the mystery litterer of Pander City. Who could it be? Hey, Dr. P. Uh, May May is kind of stuck on the swing. Oh, on my way, Bip. Sorry, June. I'll be super quick. Oh. How am I ever going to get down? It's too high to jump. Thanks to Bip. It was my turn to push. <laughs> Guess I don't know my own strength. No worries. We'll get you down. Take the other side, Bip. <clears throat> and up. <gasps> oh. <sighs> Are you okay? Yeah. Thanks, Dr. Panda. <clears throat> Great idea, Toto. Old leaves make really good plant food. <laughs> ah! That is a lot smaller. Especially my head. Mm, I see what you mean. I'll have to make the rest of you smaller as well. So that my head and body match. Uh, keep still, please. No wriggling. Oh, sorry. <laughs> oh. Oh, how am I ever supposed to finish clipping this bush? Dr. Panda, my flying hoop is stuck in a tree. I think I threw it too hard. Oh. It's my favorite. I call it the flying hoopa. <laughs> I tried to poke it down, but my twig was too short. Ah, uh, we don't need a twig. I brought a stepladder. Thank you, Dr. Panda. Huh? Okay. <laughs> to you, Olette. <laughs> <laughs> Wow! Ta-da! That is incredible! 
Oh, I feel so proud that everyone will see the... Ah! <gasps> my panda! My head! Has anyone seen my flying hooper? I threw it too hard again. <gasps> oh! I'm so sorry, June. Uh, maybe you could make the bit that's left into a teeny tiny baby panda. But I really wanted to make Dr. Panda. He's always rushing around taking care of the park. Hmm. Hey, maybe you could make it of Toto. He's the one who's been taking care of the flowers. Oh, yeah. They were all sleepy, but now they've woken up. Um, it could work. Well, Toto is easier to make than you are, Dr. Panda. He doesn't have so many sticky outfits. <laughs> Would you pose for June, Toto? <laughs> wow! What? Hey! Amazing, June. It really is Toto. But leafier. And look, now the bush is smaller. All the flowers are getting sunlight. That'll help them grow stronger. Well done, Toto. Yeah. Hi, June. Where's Moo? Hi, Dr. Panda. Does this look like a chicken to you? Uh, uh maybe. I want to make a sculpture, but oh, I don't know what to make. Anyway, Moo went to the museum. Oh, she was so excited about her dinosaur bone that she wanted them to display it right away. No, oh, I was really looking forward to seeing it. Dinosaur. No worries, guys. It's our job to look for more bones. Maybe we'll find the rest of the dinosaur. Yay! That would be so cool. Can you show us where Moo found it, June? Sure. Follow me. This is the place. Oh, thanks, June. I'm going to look for something to give me an idea for my sculpture. Okay, good luck. Ready, steady, dig! What the? Yeah. Dr. Panda, come quick. I found some dinosaur teeth. Huh? Uh, Hoopa, those aren't dinosaur teeth. I think it's part of a saw. Hmm? Are you sure? Yep. Don't give up. Just keep digging. Sure thing. <laughs> oh, you're making a sculpture, huh? Just like June. Any idea what you want to make? <laughs> Toto! Oh, good idea! <laughs> Dr. Panda! Dr. Panda! I found a dinosaur tail! Oh, it's not a dinosaur tail, is it? No, it's just a hose. Oh. Keep digging, Hoopa. I'm sure we'll find something good soon. Top. And a one, two, three, four. Whenever we're, we're together, together we're so colorful. Stop! Stop! Oh, it sounds awful. You're still way too 
Oh, Whooper! Oh, sorry, May May. And June, you're all the way up here. Well, excuse me. Bip, why are you making those weird short sounds? Because I like it. And I'll let you're still out of tune. Well, maybe the problem isn't my singing. Maybe the problem is your song. My song is fine as long as you sing it like I did. <gasps> wait, wait, May May. Isn't your song about friendship? Yeah. Well, all your friends came here to help. Oh. I'm sorry, everyone. That's okay. How am I ever going to fix my song? It's terrible. No, it's not. It's all about doing things with your favorite people. Your friends, remember? Mm hmm But what can we do? Well, maybe they can't all sing it like you can, but everyone can bring something special. Just need to change it a little. Then you come in with those quick little sounds giving us a beat. Okay. That's it. Now, Hoopa, chief me a bass line as deep as you've got. Oh, okay. Great. Keep it up. Hey, that actually sounds really good. Yeah. June, you sing the harmonies in your high voice, nice and light. And Alette, I need you to do that tooty toot thing that only you can do. <laughs> I have an idea for you too, Toto. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome, everyone. Tonight, we will be singing May May's song, Circle of Friends. <laughs> and a one, two, three. Sometimes I feel unhappy and I'm having a bad day. Nothing's working out for me and the sky is looking gray. But it doesn't really matter when I'm with all of you. <laughs> Sunshine never ends. Whenever we're together, we're a circle of friends. Oh, Dr. Panda, that was brilliant! Uh, Bip, maybe you should leave Hoopa to work on your tablets. Oh, uh, but I'm bored. <laughs> Hey! <laughs> Bip, we have to let Hoopa work. I'm sure we can find something to do. But what? We can't play outside or inside. <sighs> Everything would be better if we still had our game to play. <laughs> hey, what if we built a real-life version of your game right here in the workshop? That's a great idea. But how? We could build a track for Toto's ball on Hoopa's work table. We could use this fan. Yeah, just like in the game. Is that okay, Hoopa? Sure, go right ahead. Awesome! Let's get building! <laughs> Yay! We have to get the ball from here all the way across the table, then up there, and through the hoop into here, where it will ring a bell. <laughs> Are you ready to play? Uh-huh. Yeah, let's go. Go, go.
Bing, May May. You're up next, Dr. P. Okay. Dr. Panda. Well, let me have a go. <laughs> Yay! Yeah! Oh, great shot, Ben. <laughs> Wait for the fan! <laughs> you did it! Yay! <laughs> oh, nice going, Mimi. Thanks. Your turn, Dr. Panda. Had it. I'll do it. Oh, Dr. Panda, I made you this to say thank you for the lesson. Oh, wow. Thanks, June. It's beautiful. Oh, it was nothing. Shall we get started? <laughs> yes. Now, to drive safely, always check your mirrors and look around to see who's near you on the road. Oh, there's a cloud up there that looks like you, Toto. <laughs> okay, these are your controls. Your windshield washer, wipers, indicators to signal which way you're going when you make a turn, and horn. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see if you can remember all that. Ooh, I have goosebumps, Dr. Panda. Now, check your mirrors, signal, then drive off down the road. Mm -hmm. All clear. Good, good. What's next? Um, washer? Whoops. No, uh, this one. <laughs> no, signal, remember? Okie dokie. Uh, let's see. Good. Okay, now you can drive on. June, don't forget to steer. Watching the road. Thank you, Dr. Panda. Mustn't forget to steer. <laughs> That's it, nice and steady. Dr. Panda, that tree is moving. And it's got a face. Ah! Hi, June. Hey, Dr. Panda. Oh, it's you, Hoopa. I thought you were a tree. Uh, I'm not a tree, as far as I know. I'm just trying to move a tree that's blown over. Well, we can't go this way. Can you remember how to reverse? I think so. Uh, mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, no. Sorry. Keep calm, June. Try to remember what you need to do first. Oh, yes. Uh, check mirror. Look, there's Leo. Oh, let's say hi. Uh, maybe we should... Hi, Leo. Hey, nice socks. Oh, I just bought them. But, you know, I'm still not sure about the color. They look fine to me, so... <laughs> Dr. Panda's correct. You work in a forest, they match the trees. It's perfect. <gasps> You're so right, June. Thank you. Mm-hmm. And on with the lesson. Great to see you, Leo. Hi. So, June, do you remember what to do when you want to turn? Yes, of course. Um, oh, oh, no, not that one. <laughs> Stay calm, June. First, you signal. First, I... Oh, hi there, Alette. Hi, June. Hi, Alette. We're having a driving lesson, so... <laughs> That's great. I'm on my way to the basketball game. Go, go, Panda City Bears! Oh, my ticket! <laughs> Don't worry, Dr. Panda will get it back. I will? Just reach out and grab it, Dr. Panda. You can do it. Uh, there! Got it! 